common cold or flu almost everyone suffers so many times in a in a year uh, like uh, everyone has about 2 to 2.5 episodes per year all over the world so it is that common an illness out of that about 4 to 5% people tend to have such an ailment which causes them to suffer again and again we call that entrenched illness that is sinusitis now just to come to the basic of sinusitis we have sinuses under these that is hollow bones hollow areas otherwise the head would be too heavy like a cow's head our neck would be very thick so just to lighten it nature has given us hollow bones under the sinuses now these sinuses are not infected per se they have a good lining which keeps clearing like our lungs like our rest of our system but when we have infection like flu which is an essentially viral infection or sometimes bacterial infection this infection gets lodged into the sinuses so this sinuses the lining gets inflamed that inflammation presents as copious discharges which we all know it causes uh, running nose it also causes blocked nose because the swellings get thickened because the linings get thickened all this leads to discomfort on the part of the patient there is headache there is heaviness of the head and this can linger on generally with the proper treatment the episode clears up and in about 3 to 5 days we are much better in about 7 days they say the cold is gone now people who have got some inherent problem inside the nose like a midline bone septum which is slightly deviated this keeps on causing excess secretion formation there could be similar other changes in the anatomy of the sinuses so thereby secretion tend to collect there so they have a more chronic ailment which doesn't go away that easily that is what we call chronic sinusitis or chronic rhinosinusitis inflammation of the nose and sinuses accompanying it 